that infection rate is eight times the rate of whites. In America, AIDS is virtually a black disease by every measure. Black women are 23 times more likely to be diagnosed with AIDS than white women. We should be in the streets. Everybody should be in the streets. Everybody should be freaked out. As of 2004, more than 200,000 African Americans have died. Still, despite these stunning statistics, AIDS is a topic that remains underground in black America. Silence is now suicide. The black America's silence on this issue is suicidal. In the future, people will look back at our generation and say, what were they thinking? Good evening, I'm Terry Moran. There are times in the news when we're not watching or listening closely enough, when we miss a story, a big important story that goes underreported, mostly ignored. This is one of those stories. Let me give you one more statistic. AIDS is the leading cause of death among black American women ages 25 to 44, and it has been for 11 years. Last year, Peter Jennings began this report, and some of his work appears later in this program. It is my privilege to have picked up where Peter left off. Now, in the course of our reporting on this crisis, we discovered five important reasons that AIDS among African Americans is out of control. And as we explore them tonight, we'll talk about sex and race, neglect and denial. It's all certain to make some people uncomfortable, but this crisis demands attention. Now.